At the spraying location, open both cylinder valves until resistance is felt and release the safety lock on the applicator. Aiming the spray applicator into an appropriate waste container, purge the chemical hoses by depressing the trigger until two roughly equal streams of liquid exit the spray applicator barrel. This may take 5 to 15 seconds depending upon the length of the chemical hose set. Engage the spray applicator safety. If necessary, clean the barrel of the spray applicator with a rag. Apply the provided lubricant to the O-ring. Attach the selected nozzle onto the barrel of the spray applicator and twist until the nozzle is secure. Before beginning foam application, test spray on scrap material first to ensure even distribution of chemicals. Release the applicator safety and depress the trigger one-third to one-half of the way to meter the spray. Foam should expand and be off-white in color. Proper operating temperature is critical to product performance, so be sure that the chemical temperature in the cylinders and hoses is between 70 degrees Fahrenheit and 90 degrees Fahrenheit, or 21 to 32 degrees Celsius. If at any time during dispensing, foam quality is suspect, first replace the used nozzle with a clean, unused nozzle. If nozzle replacement does not solve the problem, refer to checking the spray foam applicator in the troubleshooting section. If spraying has stopped for more than 30 seconds, foam in the nozzle will begin to cure and clog, compromising the system performance. Replace the used nozzle. Keep in mind that higher temperatures speed curing, while lower temperatures slow curing.